let us solve one more problem. Prove that a square cot a plus b square cot b plus c square cot c equals to a b c by r. So let us solve this problem using sign rule. Okay. Now let us consider left hand side. That is a square cot a. plus b square cot b plus c square cot c now we know that small a is equal to 2r sin a small b is equal to 2r sin b small c is equal to 2r sin c this is nothing but sign rule so that means let us substitute a for 2r sin a b for 2r sin b c for 2r sin c and moreover cot a for in terms of cos and sin we have to write similarly cot b and cot c we have to change so this equals to 2r sin a all square cot a is cos a by sin a correct plus 2r sin b all square into <coughs> cos b by sin b plus c is replaced by 2r sin c so we get here 2r sin c all square multiplied by cot c in terms of cos c and sin c that is nothing but cos c by sin c so let it be simplified to get one more step so this can be written 4r square sin square a multiplied by cos a by sin a plus this is 4r square sin square b cos b by sin b plus 4r square sin square c cos c by sin c okay now you will expect the next step sin square a by sin a means you get sin a here sin square b by sin b means sin b we get here and sin square c by sin c we get sin c so the next step follows 4r square here sin a cos a plus 4r square sin square sorry sin b cos b plus okay 4r square sin c cos c now it had better to make a plan to take out 2r square common such that each of the term can be written using the formula sin 2 theta that is 2 sin theta cos theta so here for our convenience let us take 2r square common if you take 2r square common this is 2 sin a cos a plus same manner 2 sin b cos b plus 2 sin c cos c so we can write this step we have one of the important formula that is nothing but sin 2 theta is equal to 2 sin theta cos theta so now 
this can be rewritten as two r square common. This is nothing but sine two a. You can check two sine a cos a, two sine theta cos theta means sine two theta. Two sine a cos a is replaced by sine two a. Cyclic order sine two b plus sine two c. So now very very important results we have studied under transformation chapter. So that has to be recollected here and we have to keep in mind. So let me actually recall that problem. If a plus b plus c is equal to 180 degrees, the sin 2a plus sin 2b plus sin 2c is equal to 4 sin a sin b sin c. So let us recall that identity now. So now a plus b plus because it is a triangle a plus b plus c is equal to 180 degrees that implies sin 2a plus sin 2b plus sin 2c equals to 4 sin a sin b sin c. This is very very important result in transformations. So now this is replaced by as a product of the sines. So now we can write to our square 4 sin a sin b sin c. It is very interesting to our square multiplied by 4 sin a sin b sin c we can write as for our convenience this we can write 4 times 2r square sin a sin b sin c. So you might be recollecting this value this is very familiar that is nothing but one of the formulae for the delta area of the triangle. So that means this is nothing but delta for delta we can write. But see our answer is not for delta our answer is in terms of a, b, c and capital R circumradius. So that means now let us write the formula delta in terms of a, b, c and delta. Delta is equal to a, b, c by 4 r. What we have here? 4 delta. Now 4 delta is equal to just multiply this side 4 delta is nothing but a, b, c by r. This is RHS. 